Well, you really got to get over yourself in looks because as I can see, I don't look that great. But whatever, I'm very grateful for my hat. So this comfort camping, um, a young man named Julian helped us and he was amazingly um, uh, hospitable. I would highly, highly, highly recommend this place on your way. It's day two from north to south. We, we got about 30K and uh, yeah, it was incredible. We had heat, we had um, like a nice little ocean spot but where we got to just you know hang out and do our cooking and then we also had nice fresh water down there so we're all packed up and we're ready to go it looks like it should be rain today if it's not I'm not going to complain so I would say my mindset's not very good um, I know that the halfway mark where we're able to get off the trail if need be is coming up and once we pass that it's a very difficult trail which I don't really believe I was ready for but Jody uh, really wants to make this her uh, thing for her 50th so I'm gonna trek her through I'm not super happy but I will have to uh, this is where the Spartan training really comes in handy I have to tell you but I've been having a few panic attacks at night so I'm still trying to get through that and try to figure that out but um, I will persevere and I always wanted to be the turtle or the tortoise not the hare so bless our trip and um, I just pray that um, our next stop will be good. Well, we, I will um, turn the videotape on when we get to uh, the Crab Shack. That will be so much fun. But until then, we will see you. These are our wonderful outhouses. A good stopping break and uh, trail joy has uh, it's way better than going to the washroom in the trees <laughs> Right, this is where we came from <laughs> This is where we are going Okay, and we think this is yucky I am a little terrified of what's to come because supposedly this trail is still moderate it's pretty ugly down there, but we'll try it out. So after some of the ups and downs, uh, this is pretty incredible uh, scenery. We get to see the ocean as well as some of these killer rainforest trails. They're tough, but so sweet. 9.45 in the morning. We've been hiking for 45 minutes. Uh, just the beginning. But check this view out. Isn't that incredible? And it's a long way down. Smile for the camera. <laughs> Okay, I have to say, I want to stay here. <laughs> I would rather stay than walk anymore. <laughs> and this is beautiful. Just beautiful. So instead of seafood, we're doing breakfast, but uh, I think that'll be equally as amazing. But this is so cool. It came to mind that this is Bridge 66 and it looks a little worn out. So I was born in 1966, so Bridge 66 is old and worn out. Not saying that I am. Feeling it. Not saying I am. Mommy. 19, or let's say, Bridge number 68. What do you have to say, Jody? My year. Much nicer. <laughs> Much newer. <laughs> Incredible beach uh, 
shelving right now we're going on. And then we're going to get into some of these little rocks up here. Uh, day three so far has been really nice. So, break time. And Jody. And then our other gang over there. Uh, this is Travis. We are past kilometer 40 and wow, my hair is Captain looking pretty Buster sexy. I don't know, it keeps Travis flipping more and more. I don't know how much more it can flip. Anyway, it's funny. Here we are taking a break. <laughs> of course, with a killer view, if you can see that. Oh, I guess not. It's kind of blown out. But feet are sore. Uh, there's a campsite at kilometer 42. We're debating that one. And if we feel pretty good, we may run on so we can go to Shea Money for supper. So anyways, yeah. Let's see what we do. I think this is heaven. By the ocean. Thank you, God. Okay, so who says we don't get entertainment? Check this out. He brought his guitar. Nice. We're waiting for burgers now with our beer. We get music. this um, busier campsite than we're used to. Washroom is right up there. You have to actually cross all those wood pieces. Then of course there's a camp that Jody crashed. And then our tent is right there. And that train will be going on tomorrow. Cable car across and then back on the trail. So the water system is right there and then the little creek goes out this way. Isn't this cool? So I'm praying for a good sleep tonight. Um, yeah, that said, this was where the big uh, lighthouse is. So cool. Well, good night, everybody. See you in the morning. Well, I have said this before, I'm starting to feel a little bit old, but that's okay. Okay, so day three, I would say, is probably my favorite because we, um, the trails were still hard, but they were doable. I felt that we at least had a chance to feel strong. I, our legs must have been good. We were getting used to the roots. I know the worst is still yet to come, but I think as long as we take it kilometer by kilometer step by step um, but by far today is good so I just have to get through tonight and um, we can get on with tomorrow